hi guys today I decided to do a kitchen tour so yeah I'm gonna give you a first at 360 so you can see how small is my kitchen that's my kitchen guys so over here is the door to the kitchen you walk in and this is what you see to your right I have a pantry that had three cabinets on top I have dry Mexican chiles I will take it out so you can see okay guys this basket i got him from 99 cent store it was 149 i was looking for white but i couldn't find white so i had to get this color so this is what i have here all my dry chiles and it really works because my cabinets are super deep inside you can see it's kind of hard to store things and that's why I'm using this type of basket it works for me in the second cabinet this is what I have I have a bin that is labeled extra I just have extra stuff like extra chicken bouillon and other stuff in there and this one's labeled noodles it's just Michael's noodle that is in here he loves Japanese noodle and behind I have another type of noodles too I have Mexican noodles and Japanese noodles too. And on the last cabinet, this is what I have. I have um, another beans full of water. It's just water and two sodas I have in there. And over here I got Sofia snacks. Um, healthy snack and unhealthy snack. And don't worry guys, she doesn't come here and grab whatever she wants. She always come to me and ask me if she can get a candy and always ask her what have you done have you cleaned your room have you pick up your toys have you do homework so she can earn her snack that's how i do it with her and moving on on this side i have my stove and on top of those cabinet i don't have nothing because it get really greasy inside and i just hate it and yeah i wrap them with foil so it will be more easy to clean inside i don't have nothing but over here on the bottom i do have something i got my pots and pans and over here on this cabinet i have my plates and cups on top is my cups my bowls and my flat plates over here i had this lazy susan from ikea it was 9.99 i believe i don't quite remember what it was cheap it's wood and it works pretty good look and you can fit a lot of stuff in here over here i got my ninja my knife my electric can opener my utensils I got this conventional oven and over here I have the dishwasher that I don't use and on this side is a small cabinet that is really weird and I don't like it because it is have a lot of space but it's so weird in here I just have this See how weird it is. You really can you can fit a lot of stuff, but you tend to forget what you have in there. So I just put stuff in here, like baking stuff, and yeah. And over here I have an itty bitty pull out drawer that I don't like it, but I have to use it. Yeah, it's so tiny. Okay, guys, in these two cabinets. Um, I use them as my pantry um, on top 
I just had cans, canned goods all over. And over here is just pasta and seasoning mix. And yeah, let me show you. Taco seasoning mix. And you know, all those are small package. And I bought this small container from the 99 cent store. And this one, this is how it looks. Yes, guys, I'm like everybody. I think I'm not the only one who saved these small packages from fast food restaurants. Um, I mainly save the chicken filet sauce because Sophia really, really love it. And these glass containers, I bought them at Rolls. They were um, $2.99, I believe. And the label, I bought them at Walmart. And yeah, over here, these containers, well, except for this one this container i bought them at ikea and this type of containers i bought them at um 99 cent store let me show you the difference this is the difference this is the ikea one and it's cool because have this um glass in the middle so it allow you to see the ingredients you have inside um, I don't like it because they come so easy pull out and that's why I don't like it I feel like it don't keep the food fresh um, but yeah and this one I bought them at the 99 cent store and they are much bigger much fatter and that's mean you can fit more stuff in it right and I like it because the lid it won't come out easily you have to twist it so yeah so yeah this is how i organize them like i say i label everything because my husband always asking me um what is this where's that and now that it's labeled i don't have to be here him asking me oh where do you have this now he's like oh everything looks nice <laughs> and over here i have more of these containers at first i was working with this i found them out rust like i said but then one day i went to 99 cent store and i found this ones and i say hey they are cheaper and they're prettier and i like them so i decided to change and um unfortunately i cannot find them anymore um hopefully they can bring them back because i need them so this is how it looks my pantry it's really small but it i make it work it works for me and over here on the floor i just have this rug that i bought it at home i believe and over here there's two cabinets and the first one i bought this um thing from ikea that it holds your trash plastic bags that you can uh, reuse if you want and over here I just have my plate mat, my drying rack, and my pot. And I got this jar. And over here, I know it doesn't look nice, but it works for me. Um, I only have bento supplies um, for Sophia. And of the back, I only have cutting boards. Now, this one, guys, doesn't open. It's just a fake one. And yeah, that sucks. And over here is the sink. I like it and I don't like it. I like it because it's pretty big. And I don't like it because it's just one. And I just have this fold decor. And on these two cabinets, this is what I have. I have my cereal. Um, I bought these containers at Sam's Club now moving on on this cabinet on the bottom i have my tupperware i have sophia's plates and this is how i organize my tupperware and on this side i only have the lids and yeah most of my tupperware are glasses and i got some plastic ones and over here i got my other plates to serve food you know and my tortilla maker and so yeah
and over here on this one i have my utensils this small container i bought them at the dollar tree for a dollar each and over here i got my microwave and i got this small candy jar it doesn't have candy inside and on this um, cabinet this is what i have i got this um oatmeal packages and i got this um what they call i forgot the name i think they're called pot star but they're organic they're quite healthy but not really healthy and over here i just have like chocolate chips and peanut butter and yeah and on the back i just have baking liners decoration to bake cupcakes and baking mix and on top is michael's favorite this kool-aid he loves kool-aid and on this side is my ugly refrigerator i don't like it it comes with the apartment but and this uh plant my mom gave it to me it's really pretty and on the back of those cabinets i have a um, wine glass and glasses and cake stand that's all i have now i'm not gonna show you what i have inside my refrigerator because i am planning on doing a separate video and over here is the window my trash can i have this small decor in here i got this one from target um this owl from target and this pumpkin from dollar tree and this is a what's it called what they call breakfast part right <laughs> and over here this pumpkin i bought it from ross and over here on this side is where i put my condiments um so yeah this is how i had them and this type of um containers i bought them from ikea excuse the noise it's sophia um yeah i bought this container from ikea they were in the pack of four for how much three something i think and the label i got them from uh walmart and i like them how it looks they're glass and i like them and i label everything in my kitchen because my husband always asking me where's this where's that so yeah everything is labeled for him so that's it guys this is my small small kitchen hope you like it and if you like it please give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe see you in my next video bye guys